Yeah, and it's that AC that we all have cranked up pretty much all week long so far, Chris, and be just, just because of how hot it is out there. And very hot, no record temperatures, but we've been in the 90s a couple of days, and the humidity level, the dew points are so high. It makes it feel very uncomfortable. So, we don't have any heat advisories today. We don't have a, an air quality concern, but we still have extremely warm temperatures and heat indices that will be in the lower to mid 90s all day. Yesterday, we officially hit 90. That was the fifth time this year that Pittsburgh has been at 90 or above. We normally average nine days in the 90s. The warmest temperature this year, two days in late June when we hit 92. None in July, and then we've had three 90 degree days in August. Then we had the storms that bubbled up yesterday, hitting especially Allegheny and Butler counties very hard. Here are some of the rainfall totals, and boy, it varied widely. Hampton got 1.85 inches of rain, Bethel Park just under an inch and a third. Mars, two inches, Denora, an inch, Butler, more than an inch of rain. Those, that's just a sampling of the higher totals. And then to contrast that, look at Castle Shannon, just over half an inch. Cannonsburg, just over a tenth of an inch. Bell Vernon, two tenths of an inch. Uh, I know at my house it was blowing and, and the wind, and we got maybe a tenth of an inch of rain. So it was very hit or miss, but those communities that got the storms had some flash flooding and uh, trees and limbs down. Right now, we're looking at the possibility for a few more strong storms this afternoon. Doesn't look like quite as much of a chance as yesterday. Sun is starting to peak out from behind this pesky cloud cover. We're already up to 79 degrees. The dew point is at 71. It's warm, it's sticky, it's muggy. We're up to 82 in Beaver Falls and Waynesburg. Morgantown, 83 for the warm spot. And the coolest spots we see, 76 in Newcastle and Clarion right now. So the hourly forecast will be up to the upper 80s, close to that 90 degree mark in many spots by late this afternoon. And then a slight chance of a scattered shower or storm, especially after 3 o'clock. Now, the storm complex that was over southeastern lower Michigan, northwest Ohio, that has died out. The showers in southeast Ohio have died out. So we'll just have to wait and see. Once this cloud cover, you can see it's beginning to kind of uh, move out there. Once we get the cloud cover moving out, the sun comes up out, we could get uh, a couple of thunderstorms bubbling up with the heat of the day later this afternoon. But it's nothing organized. It'll just be sort of pop-up convection here and there. Tomorrow, a slightly better chance that we could see a few afternoon scattered showers and storms. And the same thing on Saturday and Sunday, and we don't get a break from the heat or the humidity until we get to Monday and Tuesday. So today, 89, some spots will hit 90. The clouds start to burn out, and we're looking at a pop-up shower or thunderstorm in spots. And here's your seven-day forecast, upper 80s all the way through Sunday. Sunshine mixing with clouds, a late day shower or storm, you know the drill. And then Monday, here comes a cold front. It'll be a series of steps down, but we finally get there. Lower humidity and cooler temps by Tuesday, Wednesday.